Kids and those struggling with hunger in the Carolinas. The Lake Lure Autumn Arts and Crafts Festival benefits two local nonprofits. Seven News is Christine Scarpelli. Right. Live at Lake Lure, like you ever need an excuse <laughs> to go there. I know. I know, it's so awesome. I know, the one thing we do struggle a little bit with is cell service, but between photographer Ryan and Patrick, the manager here at the Lake Lore Inn, these guys are a dream team. Amy putting all this together, uh, just huge thank you. Got to also thank Shannon Massey here, town manager, Lake Lore. So great because there's so much that's going on. And, you know, the Crafts Festival, the Arts and Crafts Festival, a great way to support this community coming up this weekend. So beautiful, so many arts and crafts. We got some of them here this morning. You can take a look over here, the Flowering Bridge was here represented a little bit earlier. They've got, gosh, a fairy garden that's in a mug over there. One of those is made with a pot. Um, they're just so creative. Above us is also a local artist. I could never do any of this, Shannon. I think these, arts, these artists are so talented. But with the festival coming up, the vendors, their registration fees is going to help Hickory Nut Gorge Outreach. There is a need in this community. And what a great thing that the people there, you said you, gosh, you even know how many volunteers help the community, right? Well, there's 40. There's 40 that work with Hickory Nut Gorge Outreach. Like I said before, it's a it's a great partner to have. Help us meet the needs of the folks in the community. And you know, Bill hit nail on the head last time. He was saying, "Gosh, we have a resort here. You wouldn't think that maybe there is a need, but but there but there is, especially around Thanksgiving, feeding those meals. Do you feel that's important to meet the needs in this community? Oh, absolutely. And resort towns, uh, you know, like you said, you have needs in the surrounding areas, so. We're striving to meet those needs. Awesome, Town Manager. Thank you so much for being here. Man, we appreciate it. That festival is coming up on the 20th and 21st. So this weekend, you can also donate here uh, during parking if you want to go ahead. It's free, but if you give a donation there when you park, come enjoy the festival. More than 1,000 artisans and food vendors. I don't know, guys. I'm hungry now. What do you think? Sounds pretty good. And with perfect fall weather coming for it, too. Yeah, yeah. Temperature-wise, at least. It'll be great. <sighs> Thanks, Christine.